Good morning, I'm Earl Bynum Jr. Oh, I'm from Hampton Roads, Virginia, and you're watching Gospel Awakening. This is Gospel Awakening, a viewer supported television show filled with motivating inspiration. Enjoy the show. For the Bible says, praise the Lord, all ye nations, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, all ye people, praise the Lord. I want to encourage you, but I don't want to do it by myself. So I brought along some of my friends. Come on, come on. Oh, praise him, praise him. Come on, let everything that have breath, praise the Lord. Praise the, Praise the Lord. All. All nations. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. All ye people. Oh, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. All ye nations. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. All ye Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord.
It is another one of those wonderful, good Sunday mornings, everybody. Good morning, Deborah. <laughs> good morning, Terrence. Good morning. How are you? Ah, oh, I feel great. I feel good on the inside, as they say. <laughs> <laughs> as the song said, praise the Lord, all ye nations. Oh, yes. Apps, I'm telling you, Psalm 117, this brother is doing it this morning, ain't he? <laughs> yes, my God. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Well, good uh, morning to our audience. Good morning. Thank you for joining us on this morning. Absolutely. Yes. Call your friend, neighbor. If you haven't done that yet, tell them to get up, get up. They should uh, know by now. Right now, right now. I don't care if it is the weekend. Y'all know back in the day, it didn't matter whether you had something to do or not. You had to get up anyhow, you know? Just get up. <laughs> get on up and do what with us, Terrence? Uh, ooh, have, have <laughs> coffee the gospel awakening way, everybody. Yes, yes. <laughs> let's take a sip just for a moment and I'll finish up. All right, let's do it. And tell them how they can really help a gospel awakening coffee with us. Yes. So listen, y'all. I know we've said it before, but we do want you to join us. Get up every morning, get your coffee. But more than that, go to our website and you will see the tab up there that tells you where to go to get a coffee mug. Uh, and there are other things there as well. But we really want you to have coffee time with us. Mm -hmm. And when you do receive your coffee cup, we want you to take a selfie, don't we, Terrence? Yes, please. So we can take a selfie and send it to me. It'll come directly to me. And what we're going to do, we're going to share it on our show. Well, it's got to come to you. Why can't come to me? Why? I'm just want to know. You always say come to you, but you. Why do you always say come to you? Why can't come to me? Why? Just tell me why. He's having a moment. He would be okay. <laughs> um, but as I said before. Uh, Order your coffee cup and just become a part of our coffee time on Sunday mornings at 8 o'clock. And he would be okay. Yeah, trust me. Listen, y'all need to know who it is we have on the show this morning anyway. Out of Hampton Rose, Virginia. That is correct. Okay. Earl Bynum. Earl Bynum Jr. You saw me struggling, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, y'all. Yeah. We got to go to a commercial break. But I want to say thanks to you all for watching Gospel Awakening. Earl Bynum is the bomb. You wait till we get to this interview. Y'all are going to love this guy even more. <laughs> so listen, stay right there. We're going to a commercial break. We'll be right back in just a moment. Now you can enjoy your coffee with Gospel Awakening with an original Gospel Awakening coffee cup. These souvenirs are autographed with the original signatures of the television host. Also, visit Gospel Awakenings online store and check out our other memorabilia to add to your Gospel Awakening collection. This is just another way you can help keep Gospel Television on the air for years to come. Thanks for your support. I am Ben Boris Peterkin of VB Peterkin Funeral Home. And caring for families is something we do. B.B. Peterkin Funeral Home. Families choose us because we take the time to get to know them and help decide the most appropriate arrangements for their loved ones. Your personal touch is what matters most, offering a wide range of services from life insurance to affordable cremations. B.B. Peterkin Funeral Home will make sure your final moment is just how you want it to be. Here's how you can be the next talent on Gospel Awakening. Register on our website at www.gospelawakeningnc.org. Send an email request to us at contact at gospelawakeningnc.org or call us at 984-239-8554 and we'll register you in person. Let Gospel Awakening be the avenue that takes your ministry across the world. There has been times in my life when I have not trusted God as much as I should. But through everything I've been through, I have found out that He has proven Himself to be God in my life. So I know without doubt that I'm safe in His arms. I'm not worried 
worried about what tomorrow brings. I'm safe in his arms. I'm safe in his arms. I'm not afraid of what Satan may throw my way. I'm safe in his arms. I'm safe in his arms. Come on and say. I'm safe in his arms. I'll be confident I'm safe in his arms I'm safe in his arms He is my refuge My fortress, my God I'm safe in his arms I'm safe in his arms I'm safe in his arms He is my refuge Yes, he yes. is Perfectly, if I keep my mind. the most high shall abide under the shadows of the almighty verse 7 goes on to say that 10,000 shall fall at thy right hand and none of them shall come nigh thee verse 11 says for he shall give angels charge over thee and keep thee all thy way Woo! no need to be afraid because you're home now in, in the safety of his arms you're hidden safe my sister my brother, no need to be afraid. God said, with long life, I will satisfy you and show you my salvation. He is my refuge and my fortress and my God. In him I will trust. Surely he will deliver us from the snare of the power and from the nonsense of pestilence. He shall cover us with his feathers and in his wings shall we trust. Oh! the arms of Jesus. You've been enjoying his music. He's in the house. Come on, y'all. International recording artist. Come on, brother Earl Bynum Jr. Yay! Woo <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. And look, just so folks would know, you are really sitting at a keyboard, right? Come on. I, I really am sitting <laughs> at a keyboard. I, I mean, no, let's no hear, joke. Let's hear it. Let's 
Whoa, what? see, no, he had to show off seeing that. Now, okay, <laughs> let's get on with the interview. That was just, okay, you had to just show <laughs> off. <laughs> oh, Lord. But you asked him, you you brought that point up, so he had to show and let the audience know he's actually sitting at a keyboard. <laughs> and we love it. Thank That's you. the most definite. They heard him when he first came on. You know, he sung his way into the show. I, I know, it's awesome. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Go ahead, Dev. I'll let you start. Hey, we're just glad to have you with us on this morning. Our reviewing audience loves you. You have music wow. all over the place. Wow. Thank you so much for having me. I appreciate it to you, Sister Deborah, and to Brother Terrence. Thank you all so much. I mean, I'm excited to be here. And to your audience that's watching, man, thank you all for watching. Yes. We didn't let them know that we are in... Hampton Rose, Virginia. Yes, 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 you are. And that's surrounded by seven cities, of course, for those who don't know. You have Norfolk, Hampton, Virginia Beach, Suffolk, Portsmouth, Newport News, and Chesapeake. They are the seven cities for Hampton Roads. So when did you get started singing professionally, sir? Wow. Um, I really don't know when, to be totally honest, because my mom and dad both were in groups. My dad was in a quartet group called the Gospel Travelers. Now, the Gospel Travelers, for those who know quartet, used to travel and be on the road and on stage <laughs> with people like uh, uh, Willie uh, 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 Willie Neal uh, and the Gospel Keynotes, uh, yeah. Larry Blair and the Valinaires, mm -hmm. uh, the the Highway QCs, and and uh, I still remember all of that. Uh, the Jew, uh, the Pilgrim Jubilees of Chicago, <laughs> Illinois and all of that. And my mom was in a group called the Sunbeam Singers, and they were more like the caravans. Wow. So on weekends, I had the privilege of mom on the road. I'm going with her dad on the road. I'm going with him. So I could ch choose who I was going on the road with because they were on the road. Sometimes one is at home and one is not. Sometimes both on the road on weekends. So it started there. And then all of a sudden they figured out I could play. I started playing for the groups while we were on co in concert somewhere. Mm. Yeah. All right, Dev, next question is yours. <laughs> <laughs> You've done quite a bit with um, gospel artists and you've traveled quite a bit and awards that you've received. Talk about that just a little. Uh, yeah, uh, awards. Well, I had a project called Open My Heart, or I still do have a project called Open My Heart. <laughs> <laughs> and that project was actually nominated for uh, two Stella Awards. And that was back in 2010, maybe, if I'm not mistaken. Sanchez Holly, he produced that project. Amazing. If you don't know Sanchez Holly, all you got to do is Google him. He did the rebirth of Kurt Franklin, all of GMWA <clears throat> stuff, Vicky Wine and Shirley Caesar and so many others. So he produced that project. Uh, so nominated there and then went on um, to uh, do other projects, actually. But with my church choir, we actually, it's called The Mount. We did a project. And it was Bishop K.W. Brown presents Earl Bynum and the Mount Unity Choir. That project was nominated for three Stella Awards and actually won Contemporary Choir of the Year at the Stella Awards. So thank God for that. We're the only choir, only artists out of the state of Virginia to ever win a, win a Stellar. So that is history and you know that was made and created. And we also won a Best Church Choir for the Steve Harvey Hoodie, now known as Neighborhood uh -huh. Awards as well. The Texas Music Award, we won that as well. The DMV Christian Music Awards won that as well. And the IGAA Awards won that as well. So God has been great and faithful to us in those things. And uh, other awards, I've been announcer of the year for Gospel Music Workshop of America. So won that and and uh, a few other things. So yeah, yeah, God has been great. You have your own, go ahead, Deb, go ahead. No, I was going to say, cause see, he has on a shirt. I met you at the Gospel Industry Network. There you go, talk <laughs> about that. Yeah, the Gospel Industry Network is formed out of Los Angeles, California and Hollywood, California. Bishop Kenneth Wells is actually the founder. And we have about 40 plus alliances all across the country. What that means is there are organizations across the country that we have that are lovers of music. And that's gospel music in particular. And those uh, those persons across the country, we have presidents and vice presidents and officers and, and just lovers of music. So with that national organization called GEN, uh, not that that you drink, but Gospel Industry <laughs> Network. Right. I am the senior vice president of that entire organization. Yeah. 
travel, you will go anywhere. Viewers are wanting to know where where do you go? Where do you travel? How can you know? We got your information. We see the information yeah. how to reach you, but let them know how far you travel. I'll go wherever wherever you are. Uh, I've had 22 world tours, by the way, in the countries of Spain, Italy, Switzerland, Denmark, and Japan, and uh, I absolutely love it. Uh, I haven't gone since COVID, but 22 straight years, I've had 22 world tours, and they have been amazing. Uh, I get the opportunity to take other people with me that would have never gotten to travel that way. Uh, so it's it, we do uh, about 10 concerts, 10 different cities while we're there the entire time, about three weeks. So we're on the road, off the road, sleep, breakfast, on the road, off the road, sleep, breakfast, concert, on the road. And that's how it is. So if I can travel there, I can travel to you. So if you want me, call me. I'll come. I do concerts, workshops, weddings and divorces. <laughs> Well, you are. Hey, listen, now I'm going to mess with you because we have to go to a commercial break, but this is what I want. This is, I've got to first let me applaud you, man, for all of your accomplishments. We didn't get to everything, but okay. as we're going to a commercial break, I want you to create something real quick and say, um, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Can you do it? Come on. You can do it. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this commercial break. <laughs> I am Ben Boris Peterkin of VB Peterkin Funeral Home. And caring for families is something we do. VB Peterkin Funeral Home. Families choose us because we take the time to get to know them and help decide the most appropriate arrangements for their loved ones. Your personal touch is what matters most, offering a wide range of services from life insurance to affordable cremations. VB Peterkin Funeral Home will make sure your final moment is just how you want it to be. Now you can enjoy your coffee with Gospel Awakening with an original Gospel Awakening coffee cup. These souvenirs are autographed with the original signatures of the television hosts. Also, visit Gospel Awakening's online store and check out our other memorabilia to add to your Gospel Awakening collection. This is just another way you can help keep Gospel Television on the air for years to come. Thanks for your support. Here's how you can be the next talent on Gospel Awakening. Register on our website at www.gospelawakeningnc.org. Send an email request to us at contact at gospelawakeningnc.org or call us at 984-239-8554 and we'll register you in person. Let Gospel Awakening be the avenue that takes your ministry across the world. We want you to know that we're so grateful for your support, faithfulness, showing up, all of that matters to us. And we just wanna thank, take the time to thank you. To those of you who actually send in financial support to, to the TV show, thank you so, so very much. And listen, talk to your friends, you know, encourage others to support us. Gospel Music TV, Come on, y'all. It's dying out, but we're not going to. We're bringing it all back on TV because people love gospel music. They love watching these artists, talking to, watching them in videos. And we are excited to be able to share and bring that back to TV. Yes. And thank you. It's all because of your support that this happens. And so today we just want to continue to share with you whether you're uh, contributing financially or not. Um, you know, you can at least like us or subscribe to us, follow us, YouTube, Facebook, go to the website. All of these things that you do, uh, it really does matter in this industry. And okay. so we're depending on you to keep this going because honestly, I look forward to seeing my sister every Sunday morning with you all on Gospel Awakening. Do you look forward to seeing me too, Deb? Most definitely. <laughs> I mean, my baby brother. Yes, she I is do, but listen, I know, she, I know she doesn't like that part, but listen, I do want to say the last thing. Please go to our website and order your, your coffee mug. And please take a selfie with you and the, and the coffee cup and send it to me 
we're going to put it on the show and just share and show the world just how much you support God for Awakening. Amen. And everybody, until another awesome and wonderful Sunday morning, thank you for doing what you do for us. And we'll continue doing what we do for you as well. We'll see y'all when? Next Sunday. <laughs> 8 o'clock. <laughs> see you Bye. later. Bye, y'all. Bye. Let's say I am. I am. I am. No more change. No more change. I'm free. I'm free. Oh, yes, sir. Come on, let's say it again. I am. Simply says, I am free. Praise the Lord, I'm free. No longer bound, no, no. No more chains holding me. My soul is resting. It's just a blessing. Gospel Awakening is supported by viewers like you. We hope you've enjoyed this program. And until next time, God bless you. Say something.